Hello, welcome to Izzy's to World. Thank you for coming to my channel. You could have been anywhere, but you came to my channel. And for that, I'm always extremely grateful. Thank you so much. I am going to do an Aquarius love prediction reading for all for September 6th through excuse me through September 12th. Please keep in mind this is a general read. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Don't try to make it your story. In addition, if you enjoy my reading, please give me a subscription or a like. I will be most humbled, most honored, and I'm always very grateful. Keep in mind, this energy can go either way. It can be your energy, your significant other's energy, or someone else's in your love space energy as well. Keep that in mind as you watch and as you listen. Let's see what's going on. What's going on with my aquas? What's going on with my Aquarius? Show me, spirit guides. What's going on? What's going on with my Aquarius? Show me, spirit guides. My wonderful, eccentric, kind, sweet persistent loving Aquariuses. What's going on with my Aquarius spirit guys? Show me spirit guys. Let's see Aquas what you got going on. Two of Cups. The Fool. Death card. The Tower. Ah Three of Cups. Oh my Aquarius. Aquarius Aquarius Aquarius. Who is this that you love? Who is this that you're in love with, Aquarius? That two of cups means your heart space is on fire for someone. Someone that you love dearly. Someone that you, you know, whenever you guys are together, the energy is this there. You feel each other. You know each other. You want to touch them. You want to love on them. You guys are just on one space when you are together. That energy just flows and you can feel that energy when you are together with them. Something has happened, though, because you're asking for a new beginning with them. You want a new beginning with them. The full card means new beginning. What did you do, Aquarius? What happened? Why do you need a new beginning? There, There's something that has happened that you want a new beginning with them. You want a new beginning with them. Then you have the death card, which could be a Scorpio person. But the death card is also a card of transformation. Trend, you know, I think that maybe you started out just a little crazy with them. I don't know, but I'm going to keep reading to find out. But something has happened that you need a transformation with them so that you can get a new beginning. You want a new beginning, so you have made a transformation. You have made a transformation. They have made you not coerced you. You wanted to make a transition. They made you, you have a new transition, a new transformation with them. The tower card here means to me that you have drawn down or you have lit up or you have broken up everything that was prior. Everything that happened prior, you have said no. You want this new beginning, right? You have stopped this. This was a sudden. You suddenly said, no, this is not, I want to love you this way. That's what I see. I want to love you this way. Don't, whatever happened before, you really don't care. You want to love them a certain way, so you need to break up what you had in the beginning. Well, not, and I don't even know what I'm saying in the beginning. Well, what you had before, what you had before, maybe you didn't come at them correctly. Maybe there, was, there were lies. I don't know, but whatever it is, you want to break that up with that tower card. You have a transformation going on because you want to break that up. You want to show them what kind of person you truly are. Three of Cups is here. Yeah, because you want to, you have a good time when you're with them. You party with them. You enjoy each other. This person you love and adore. This is a person that you love and adore. And you want to have a new beginning. You want to break down anything that happened before that was negative to make everything positive. Give me another three to five minutes. I'm going to clarify the cards for you. The first five cards, I just give you a general overview to tell you what's really what's going on. If this is your read, give me three to five minutes and let me clarify the cards so I can tell you what the spirit guides want you to know. Why is this two of cups here? Show me spirit guides. Why does Aqua have a two of cups here? Show me spirit guides. Show me spirit guides. Uh, you have a knight of swords. You're being very courageous. Yeah, you're being very courageous. I told you you want a new beginning with them. So you're being very courageous because you know why? You love this person. You are in love with this person. So you're being very courageous. You're stepping to them and saying, I need a new beginning. I need a new beginning with you. I need a new beginning. I love you. I need a new beginning. So let's see why is the food card here for you. Show me why the food card is here. Show me, spirit guys. Why is the food card here for my aquas? Show me why is the food card here for aquas? Ah, you have the chariot. 
not only do you want a new beginning, you are determined. That could be a cancer person as well. But whatever this is, you are determined to have a new beginning with them. You are saying, look, I know, but I love you. I know I might have messed something up in the beginning. I was going to say mucked up something in the beginning. But I want a new beginning with you. I want a new beginning with you. The chariot card means moving forward new beginning you want to you um with the full a new beginning so you're moving forward with a new beginning with them you want a new beginning let's see why the fool card why the uh death card is here show me why the death card is here show me spirit guys why is the death card here oh my yeah thank you spirit guys whenever the spirit guys give you two cards the same the tower card yeah, the transformation here, you have blown up everything that happened in the past. You want to move forward on a new direction. You want to show them what you can bring to the table for them. You love them. You don't you don't want to lose them. You want to show them. The tower means you have blown up everything that happened in the past. You don't want that. You have you you your energy and your love space for them is incredible. You love them immensely and you want to show them that. Let's see why the tower is here. Let's see. Show me why the tower is here. And that transformation means that you have blown it up so that you can get a new beginning, to transform into a new beginning with them. So let's see. Oh, let's see. Your cards want to want to jump out to me. Hold on. Let's see. Why is the tower card here again? Show me why the tower card is here again. Ah, you have the Prince of Swords or the Princess of Swords. Yeah, because you're trying to communicate with them. Um, you're letting them know, like I said, here's a tower card again, but this tower is telling them you're communicating with them every which way you're showing them. I'm, you're breaking down every barrier, all the bull crap. You're breaking it all down. The Prince of Swords means that you communicate with them. You're communicating with them on a regular basis. You're communicating with them. You're letting them know Instagram, Facebook, text. Whatever. You're letting them know, I want to start over. I want a new beginning. I love you. I am in love with you. That is what's going on. You can't You can't stop it. Love, you know, has no boundaries. You just can't stop it. The Prince of Swords is a communication card. You are communicating with them that you want to start afresh. You want to start anew. You want a new beginning. Let's see. The Three of Cups. Show me why the Three of Cups is here, Spirit Guides. Can you show me why the Three of Cups is here, Spirit Guides? Ah, look at that Eight of Swords. Yeah, you are tied to them. There is a connection to them that you can, is unbreakable. Something, you've tried to shake this person. There is a connection that is unbreakable. But if you can get them to understand, because what Three of Cups means that you're having a good time with them. You always have a good time with them. That's why you can't break it. You can't break it because whenever you're in their energy, you almost lose yourself in a good way. Because they don't harm you. They don't talk crazy to you. They're good to you. They love on you. And you may have started, like I said, a little whacked in the beginning. You didn't know how this was going to be. This is something that, you know how you fall in love with someone. You don't even realize you're in love with them. You're like, oh my goodness. That's what has happened with this relationship. Two of Cups. Two of Cups at the very beginning means that you love someone. Your heart space is the same. You guys love each other. You hold. You can hold hands together. Your hearts are the same. You just simply love them. Um, and then you have the Knight of Swords. You're being very courageous because you want a new beginning. Something happened. You may have lied. You may have done something. Or they may have lied. Whatever. Something happened at the very beginning. But you want a new beginning. The Chariot is a Cancer person possibly. Could be anyone, but the chariot card means that you are determined. You are determined to get a new beginning with this person. You don't care. You're determined. Then you have the death card, which could be a Scorpio person as well. And you have the tower that's over the death card, which means you've broken down everything. All the bull crap, all the stuff that you had before, you blew that up because you want a new beginning with them. Then you have the tower again, which means right here you broke, you have once again broken up everything. And then you have the Prince of Swords. You're letting them know. You're not holding back anything with them. You're letting them know. No, I want to be with you. This is how I want to be with you. You're showing them. You're texting them. You're calling them. You're emailing them. You're voicemailing them. You're letting them know that you love them and you love them dearly. You love them sincerely and you love them dearly. Then you have the three of cups, which means you have a good time when you're with them. You're tied to this person because the eight of swords is there. You can walk at any minute, but you can't walk. You and this person have an attachment to each other. There's no way you can walk from this person. This energy is strong. It's very, very strong energy. A strong energy. A strong, good, loving energy. So let's see. Show me, spirit guys. Show me. Give me. 
an angel oracle card for them. Give me an angel oracle card. Oh, forgiveness. Uh, I think that you're asking for forgiveness for someone so that you can um, be with them again. Because this has been something, like I said at the very beginning, it started off right, but it started off not in the right area. I don't think it started off right. I don't. But I think that you, you realize that you want to be with them because you fell in love with them. You're asking for forgiveness so that they can be in your life. This is what I have for you for your love prediction reading, Aqua.